Welcome to CHF Informations. What is the Russian sleep experiment? You might be wondering how long you can go on like that, especially if you haven't been getting enough sleep lately. How long could you stay awake without falling asleep as a result of sleep deprivation? Some claim that there was an outlandish experiment for that. It is quickly debunked by experts. The Russian sleep experiment is a popular urban legend that began to circulate online in creepypasta forums, so-called because of the ease with which spooky content could be copied and pasted, in the early 2010s. But could this deeply disturbing legend have some truth to it? According to legend, Soviet-era scientists developed a stimulant that they believed would allow soldiers to go without sleep for up to 30 days. They decided to test their new gas on five prisoners, promising them their freedom if the experiment was successful. They sealed the five men inside a hermetically sealed chamber and started pumping in the gas. Within a few days, the men developed the paranoia and psychosis that is a common symptom of sleep deprivation. But as time passed, they began to act even stranger. Fifteen days into the experiment, when scientists could no longer see or hear the men through the thick glass of the chamber, they filled the room with fresh air and unlocked it. They discovered that one of the men had died, and the four surviving test subjects had all suffered horrifyingly violent injuries, some of which appeared to be self-inflicted. Attempts to sedate the men either failed or resulted in their deaths the moment they lost consciousness. Finally, when one of the researchers inquired as to what these men had become, the last surviving test subject explained that they represented the potential for evil that exists in all humans and is normally contained by sleep, but had been unleashed by their constant wakefulness. That is terrifying. Randy Gardner set the current documented world record for staying awake for a little more than 11 days in 1963. Gardner experienced severe behavioral and cognitive changes during those 11 days, despite his desire to demonstrate that there is no harm in not sleeping, according to Dr. Sue. He also had mood swings, memory problems, difficulty focusing, paranoia, and hallucinations. While it is true that amphetamines have been used to keep soldiers alert during times of war in the past, there is no scientific evidence of a gas that could keep anyone awake for 15 days. Furthermore, studies have shown that after just 48 hours of not sleeping, people become slower, disoriented, more prone to making mistakes, and ultimately less effective as soldiers. Since the brain can't function properly after being sleep-deprived for 11 days, it's safe to assume things would get much worse if one tries to stay awake longer, he says. As a result, even if they had miraculously managed not to sleep for 30 days, those soldiers would have been useless. Still, whoever came up with the story of the Russian sleep experiment deserves credit for creative writing, if not medical accuracy. That's all we have for now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.